Connellsville native married to a decorated war hero is now charged with murder and is not only getting support from President Trump, but locally as well. Charges against the former Green Beret have sparked a large military investigation and now debate as to whether those charges are justified. Pam Serrano has the story from Connellsville. In Connellsville, a lawn sign reads, Only two forces in life were willing to die for us, Jesus Christ and an American soldier. This is the hometown of Julie Ruck Goldstein, married to Major Matthew Goldstein, the Afghanistan war veteran and special forces officer facing murder charges for killing a suspected Taliban bomb maker in 2010. The lawn sign belongs to her former homeroom teacher at Connellsville Area High School. School, who founded a nonprofit supporting the region's deployed and veterans. Linda Shearer also took to Facebook this weekend with this passionate post urging others to contact local legislators to stand up for justice after the Army announced Goldstein would be charged with premeditated murder. The president got involved taking to Twitter after Goldstein's story made national news saying, I will be reviewing the case of a U.S. military hero, Major Matt Goldstein charged with murder. He could face the death penalty from our own government after he admitted to killing a terrorist bomb maker while overseas. Goldstein's wife says she's grateful for the president's support. It is fabulous that it got the president's attention. And if that is who has to step in to fix it and make it right, so be it. Instead of enjoying a happy time, the couple just welcomed a new baby into the world. Ruck Goldstein is defending the character and service of her husband, disputing the claim he admitted to assassinating a suspected terrorist bomb maker during his deployment after a booby trap killed working in his unit. He helped track down the sniper and earned a silver star for valor. My husband took care of an enemy combatant who did harm and was planning to do harm, more harm. But after lengthy investigations, the Army says documents surfaced showing Goldstein allegedly told CIA agents he killed the Afghan bomb maker, conspiring with others. Pam Serrano, KDKA News.